<laughs> hey, this is Frank. Well, I told you earlier we're going to start off with our first installment of Aging Ruthlessly video series. This is about training with Mace Fit for longevity. Now, first of all, what the heck is longevity? I hear a lot of young guys talking about it. They're in their 40s and they're reading books on it. Okay, that's better than not doing anything. That's better than not learning. But how about this? Once you live to be older and then tell people about longevity. So that's why I'm here today. So God willing, I'll be in my 70th year in about 10 more weeks. So a little bit of longevity has come my way already. I'm very blessed. So what we're gonna to do today is go about how to start off, okay? How to start off if you have never done this before or if you have and you need a refresher, that's fine. So we're gonna do a few simple exercises today, mainly warm up and we'll progress on uh, throughout the week and the upcoming weeks for uh, more advanced stuff. So what you would need to start off with, what I have here with me right now is a club, an Addicts Adjustable Club, okay? Now these will uh, have the end come unscrew, put your weights on, screw it back on. These are great. Right now this is five pounds. I have an Addicts Adjustable Mace, same thing. This is 15 pounds right now. You can tell I've got two weights on here, a five here and a two and a half here, and a seven and a half pound hammer makes it 15. Now these will go up to 60 pounds, from seven and a half to 60 pounds. Good range. And what I also have here is, for the raw beginner, or somebody on a budget, is the bare knuckle mace. This is fixed weight, 10 pound mace. So we'll start off um, in the beginning using this, so if you are new, and like I said, if you're on a tight budget, then this is ideal. Okay, so I'm gonna set this other one aside for just a minute. Okay, a couple more things. You need to have water, of course. All right, it's summer and we're in Florida, but even if you live up north, have your water, stay hydrated, and chalk. Going to start off with we're going to start uh, doing americanas, one hand americanas with the with the club. So we're going to start from here, and we're going to swing it out and around. Simple exercise, takes a little getting used to in the beginning, but don't stress about it, okay? We're gonna move on to inside mills. When we say inside or outside, inside means you're crossing the center line of the body. Outside means you're moving away from it, okay? So we're gonna come from here. Now if you're brand new, just set your club up here. Pull your elbow down across the front of your body. Bring it right back to there. And when you put them together, same thing when you go to the other side, start right here, come around. You find yourself wanting to turn slightly. That's okay. Now, you've heard the expression, no pain, no gain. 
Flush that. Train for longevity. No brain, no gain. We're gonna move on next. We're gonna do a stretch. Very simple stretch. I'm not gonna hold it for the full time, but I'll tell you how long we would do it for. Okay? I take the mace, I'm gonna lower it down behind you, bring your elbow up straight towards the ceiling. Now what you want to do is hold this for 60 seconds on each side and go through twice. For right now, I'm just going to hold it about 30 seconds on each side just so you get an idea of how to do it. Besides, it gets boring to watch somebody do a static stretch. When you get uh, hit your time mark, we have to change over. Reach back with the other hand, grab the knob, pull it up slightly, change hands, lower it back down, do your other side. Very, very simple. When you're ready to take it down from the stretch, reach around behind you, just grab the mace, bring it back around, set it down. Show you one more warm-up exercise. It's called Barbarian Knee Walk-Ups. On these here, Barbarian, anytime you hear that word, means you're holding the mace out like this. I'm gonna move a little bit so I can step off the mat. So we're gonna go down to both knees, Go down under control. Come back up. Don't go, go down so hard to smash your knee in the floor. Okay, that's it for today. Stay tuned, more to come.